Okay, welcome to Let's Play Sundays. It's Entertainment Talks video game Let's Play series. I've forgotten the intro. Um, yeah, we're back with Moss, back with some VR games. It's been a while since I played any VR things. Um, and uh, got one thing to talk about first, right? This blue ball that's here. I don't. I can't point at it because that won't work. Um, this blue ball. When I loaded this game, right? Uh, I loaded it and it loaded me into this area. I press, I press pause so that when I put my headset on, it could be in the pause menu and I could sort of set myself and be ready to go, if you will. Um, then, let me just turn this down a bit. There we go. Um, and uh, yeah, this blue ball thing was right kind of here in my face on on the left. Every time I sort of looked to the left, it was a. I thought it was because I can't remember a damn thing about this game. Um, apart from you control Moss and, and that's about it. Uh, I thought it was some sort of like glitch or I, I, I damaged the VR. It, 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 it looked really weird. It looked like a glitch. So um, I know that sounds pretty stupid, but when you haven't played a game for several months and you sort of forget that it's there, uh, you might end up thinking something like that. Anyway, yes, this blue ball, I'm talking, it was sort of here or something. So I was like turning around and it it didn't look like a ball though. It looked like. It wasn't supposed to be there. Anyway, let's continue. Cut these down. <laughs> um. Mm-hmm. So this game, I just looked on um, howlongtobeat.com, which is a good website for uh, tracking, that kind of thing. Um, and it said that this game is about four hours long. I've played at least two hours, I want to say. Um, <clears throat> Can I not go around, around there? Oh, probably wasn't supposed to do that. Um, just wondering if I've got to move this somewhere else. But it's on the platform already. Oh, I see what you meant to do. We have to go that way instead. But I uh, hope you're all doing well. Um, by the time this goes up, the coronavirus will probably still be a thing. I know you don't really want to hear about that when you go to watch me play a relaxing game like Moss. Well, a relatively relaxing game. Um, but, uh, yeah, because this will obviously come out a few weeks after I've recorded it. Okay. Where is he? There he is. All right, we're gonna have to fight some stuff. It looks like possibly. How was? How did I know? <laughs> All right, he's damaged. Yes. Oh, there's another one. Oh, can I push him off? No. That's not good. Okay, we passed. 
I want to go a trophy. Oh, yeah, come. Echo through the trees. Fought like someone who has stolen our champion's power. Bright white loading screens. I don't like it. You don't need them. <sighs> anyway. A small yet fantastical band of sprites emerged <laughs> surrounding Quill. I'm Veda, root seer of the mire. And you have crossed into our domain. She sized up Quill with a rueful gaze, then turned her attention upward. Since you there too, I have not felt the presence of such a promising reader in some time. A youthful warrior marched forward. Rootseer! I'm prepared to honor our great champion's legacy. Rodent, <coughs> give us our glass. Quill stepped closer. Where is my uncle? If you hurt him... Silence! Beta thundered back. It was Argus who summoned us here, and now I see why. Young one. I'm afraid the trees hum of attack. Your uncle's been taken to the castle of your ancestors. Quill's knees buckled as Veda continued. Argus put himself at great risk calling for us. Your uncle once took a solemn oath to protect the glass of your fallen king. He is the only one left who knows where it's been hidden. The Arcane have long sought to wrest that knowledge from him. <laughs> and do you dare to cross into the mire with our glass? Sarfog will soon burn through this forest looking to tear you and your reader apart. Unless, of course, you find them first. Take these. Weapons made for the mighty champion who died so that your people could live. Quill felt its otherworldly power course through her. Find your uncle, Twofold, before the serpent oh, we got a new sword? masters break him. Or something? The warrior fumed. Our glass with her? Rootseer! She's minuscule! <laughs> now, the reader has chosen its hero. We must let their story unfold. Veda replied with a frost of finality and vanished into the shadows of the mire. Stop it. God, dearie me. <sighs> okay. So, yeah, I've got a new sword, basically. Right, that obviously needs to go. Sorry if you can hear the dog. Great, let's just go into this tunnel. Into this dark place. I remember there's a snake in this game. From the demo that I played, I think. Wow. It was Quill's favorite story. <laughs> He's so small. How Sir Argus fought beside the Sprite Champion to seal this temple from the Arcane. And secured the survival of their kinds. Simply standing in their heroic footsteps felt like a great honor. 
Okay. Another trophy. That's good. Oops. I genuinely didn't see that gap there. So. Um, right. Oh, my camera doesn't like that. Did he just give me a thumbs up? <laughs> I just sort of saw that at the end. Alright, now I'm assuming, yeah, let's go around this way. Good game so far, I'm, I am enjoying it. Um, I sort of forgot how good it was, to be honest. Um, there wasn't a particular reason I stopped playing it or dropped off. I just, I guess I was busy with other stuff at the time. Well, I'm going to have to fight all them, aren't I? Obviously. Can I, have I healed him? Brilliant. Nice. Oh good. Can I make you attack each other? Whoops, no. I forgot I could do that actually. Whoops. Right, about. Damn, this thing's sensitive. Whoa. Alright. Okay. We march on. Move forward. Whatever. I think I see. Apparently not. Um, can you move that? No. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. What did that do? Nothing? I was thinking if Huh, I was thinking if I push that all the way in I could climb on 
push that all the way in, I can climb onto that, pull that back out, climb onto it, and then climb onto there, pull that, and then do something else. Oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So my plan worked. Just not quite the way around that I thought. <laughs> oh, hello you. Can I pull you off the edge? No, apparently not. Yay, that's what I wanted to do, wasn't it? Anymore? Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do. Goodbye. <laughs> Got branches. Going, going to swing from something. Or one of you. Jesus. Come on. I can do better than that. Alright guys, well I think I'm going to leave it there for this episode of Let's, Let's Play Sundays. Thank you all very much for watching. I might be back with more moss. I might finish it tonight. I'm not sure, but uh, we will see how things go. But thanks for listening. EntertainmentTalk.org is where you can find everything else. And I'll see you next time. Goodbye.